Jeff calls out Snapchat for working with Dobrik. This is kind of interesting development. He's Jeff is he's still doing surgeries and stuff. So like for everybody else, it's like move on, dude. But like he's still a crane. He's, he's still crane doing head. surgeries. Yeah, so he for posted him, he has one like next week. Yeah, still very much a thing for him. So at Snapchat, you're paying a guy that smashed my skull in for a prank and left me with lifelong injuries. He also filmed and organized multiple essay. That's why I stopped posting. I don't want blood money. Ooh. What do you say about that, Snapchat? They don't give a fuck, man. They're like, dude, that's our bread and butter. Sexual predators <laughs> is like who we are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. I put together an album of some of the responses. I can't believe he was getting hate for this. Yeah, where do these people come from? I wonder if um, Dobrik has like a uh, bot farm defense fund. You know, <laughs> it's hard to believe that people are actually riding for Dobrik in 2024. Uh, Seeing how many likes these comments got. It makes me wonder as well, to be honest. Without David, you'd be homeless on the Jersey Shore. Well, this guy knows he's got ETH. He's, mm. a, he, he's into Ethereum. Thick. Meat Rider, I made millions from selling weed when you were in diapers. <laughs> <laughs> he's right. I mean, he was a drug dealer. He might be in jail, but he wouldn't be homeless. Right. Let's, be, let's be respectful. <laughs> the whole of time? Uh, Jeff, honestly, at this point, just stop. You're using his name and what he did for clout and money. You can't live off t talking about someone else. You can't live off talking about someone else? What's the question? Oh, he says, talk about someone else. Okay. He's got no clout anymore, and I don't need or want any more anything. from. I'm doing just fine on my own. Jeff, oh, he's getting in the weeds with these goons. Who are these people like standing Duberg, man? I mean, he's got a big audience on Snapchat. <sighs> I bought into this. Then I went and Googled what happened. You let someone swing you around from an excavator. You had to have known that wasn't safe. What did you think in the beginning happened? I bought into this, this until I realized somebody actually slammed you into the fucking excavator. I thought you were driving it yourself. Doesn't even make sense. The comment. I hate him too, but why would you agree to swing from a crane? And even worse, why would you do this knowing the person manning it is not qualified? Hold on. What? What is... I'm getting bot farm. I'm getting cab cab. I, that's what I'm saying. The first two that you read had a 1K likes. This one has 500 <laughs> likes. That is so strange to but me. But also, it's like the same angle. I I haven't seen like detractors being like, um, bro, it's your own fault because uh, you let an unqualified person... It's like, dude... That's not what happened, first of all. He, he got him on there and then went crazy with it. Cry me a river, bro. He never forced you to swing off the excavator. You were once chasing that blood money. Wow. I didn't, I didn't know about these people. Nope. Nobody cares, Jeff. You signed up to do it. He did not force you to do it. Laughing, crying emoji. Genuine question. How much of the accident do you consider to be your fault? Dude, well, that's, that's the rational thinker right there. So. Okay. She got a point. Got a point. Your fault. Irrational. Can you, uh, AB, independently, can you see if these are like real accounts? Mm hmm. I just, I'm curious what like the rational thinker is tweeting about otherwise. You Not know. your fault. I have a guess. <laughs> uh, did you not agree to the prank? You chose to do it, get over it, and make smarter decisions next time. I, how are all these people really? Yeah. Well, I'm with you, Jeff. You know, I'm with you. Um, Although this okay. guy does have ETH, which is pretty compelling. Okay, ETH. And what appears to be a cool exclusive NFT. ETH. Of a, it's very cool. Okay, Ethan. Thank you, Jeff. Okay, Jeff. ETH. Um, Logan responded by calling David a loser. Okay, let's see what uh, Logan had to say. Logan. Yo, uh, he said David Dobrik is a loser. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Real quick, that ETH guy. Logan Bridge? Mm, yeah. Logan Bridge? I did, I did get a text from Mike today that said H3X <gasps> impulsive question mark. Let's fucking go. And I said, bro. Well, I said, you know, I'm, I'm Logan always. Logan Bridge? I, I like, can you provide more details? <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I'm down anytime they want. I sent you that ETH guy's uh, Twitter banner. <laughs> okay. Um, for real? This is his fucking banner for real? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna 
stop dissing the Nazis all the time. I'm, I'm, it's even dumber uh, and worse than I imagined. That was my prediction be. for the rational thinker, not this one, but, um, you know, point stands, I guess. So there, here's your defenders, David. <laughs> Uh, these are your people, man. Soak it in. Wow. Okay. Wow. Wow. Incredible.